I did, like, I marked my starting point and my ending point, and I hopped to see how many grid squares there were. And on this line, there were seven. I knew this was, like, a rectangle, so it, it would be the same on both sides. So, I didn't exactly have to count this one. I just did this on both sides, and then seven and seven, and four and four. So here what I did was I did four plus four equals eight, and seven plus seven equals 14, and 14 plus eight equals 22. And here, 22 meters. And here I did the same thing, four meters, four meters, eight meters and eight meters, four plus four, eight, eight plus eight, sixteen, sixteen plus eight, twenty-four meters. And that's the same thing here and here. So six, six, four, four, four plus four equals eight, six plus six equals twelve, and those two equals twenty meters. And here three, three, eleven, eleven, 3 plus 3 equals 6, and 11 plus 11 equals 22, and all together they equal 28. So that's, so, and at the back, it has questions for you. So this one, what is, what is the total perimeter that Bella would need to hop around? Show your work. So I wrote down here, the total perimeter Bella hopped around was 94. What we did was we added 22 plus 20 plus 24 plus 28 and got 94. Then we calculated our work and our calculation was right. That's what we did for that. And then there was this other question, if Bella can hop uh, five meters in one minute, how long would it take her to hop around all of the houses? Show your work. So we used a one centimeter grid paper here. We copied off the same houses using the squares. Then we marked our first spot and our ending spot. Then we hopped five, and then we drew an arrow showing one minute for each one. That's what we did on this, 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 this. Here we had two extras. Here